Hello watch fans, Both Year Watches here and this time for you we have a circa 1953 Ernest Burrell automatic. Now this has the uh, Banator movement so the movement spins both ways and charges or, or winds the watch in both directions. It also has this lovely outer part of the dial with this texture on. Not even sure the camera is going to pick it up much. Reminds me much of a Longines that we did have once that sold immediately, which I probably let go too cheap. But this is a much cheaper watch. One of the reasons it's cheaper is this is in gold plate rather than in 18 karat gold like the Longines was. Uh, and it has some damage. It has some damage on that bottom lug, which you may not have noticed because you were looking at the dial. That doesn't mean you're a bad watch buyer. That just means that you're distracted by something really good. But as I say, there's some damage there. There's a couple of little marks on this side as well. Screw down case back. The automatic movement has the uh, Inca Star fine adjustment on, unique to Ernest Burrell watches. The crown, probably, a, it's a perfect fit, but probably a later replacement because it's the, the wrong colour. And the strap is used, but as you can see, hardly used. So it wasn't worth taking it off because it does look rather good on it. You've got a calendar, no quick set date on this, so it's not the best, but it is quite a small calendar, so whether you bothered to set it would be down to you. But it's that outer edge of that dial which really makes this stand out. You can see more on this watch at berthierwatches.com, including wrist shots and movement photos, or by clicking the pinned link below. Thanks for watching.